Hello, today we are at Sharewire, full service mobile agency, and we're going to talk to Michael Gaway about wireframes. Come and join me. Uh, I see a, a wireframe as a, as a blueprint of your uh, new platform um, and it depicts per section of the website or the app or per screen what information should be on there but also what interactions take place uh, from where uh, which point or button or action a user goes to a new screen or a new section um, and you can also on a higher level uh, point out if it's a picture or text or a video uh, but we always keep uh, keep away from more details uh, like colors or icons uh, because then when discussing a wireframe uh, with a client um, it often already ends up going into the details like oh but this icon is not clear enough well you're not trying to discuss the icons but tr mm -hmm. tr trying to discuss the information that you want to present to the user yeah. because if it's too abstract the client won't get it um, it's too difficult to find the hierarchy if it's too detailed um, the discussion will be about the visual styling like Michael says and so it's, you want to keep it in between and that's the biggest challenge of uh, of inter or wireframes or flows yeah. or yeah. but yeah, because it's uh, it's a quick way of putting thoughts on paper um, it's a great tool for designers as well to to look at how the flow of the app or website should be usually the quickest is to hand sketch uh, it's also a matter of preference uh, some people really like to put it directly uh, into the computer, make it nice and... Uh, yeah, snap but the buttons right in place. And exactly. Put some text in there. Well, you can uh, just, with, with a sketch, you can just draw some lines, make a box with a cross in it to represent uh, the picture. And 